Warriors, hi, welcome to uh, part two of your uh, second half of January 2021 general read. Um, no particular subject, we'll take an issue, something you're aware of, something you're not aware of, recent past, immediate future, and potential outcome. We'll clarify and get something out there. It's not going to resonate for every single Aquarian, so do check out your other placements, your Moon, your Rising, Venus, any Stellium you have in your chart, for further messages. Okay, thank you once again for the likes, shares, subscribes, comments, everything continues the growth of the channel, it's been much appreciated. So if you haven't done so, please do. And if you want to delve into your own situation deeper, check out the description box for details of private read. Okay. There is one more. Ooh, the King of Pentacles. Now we're feeling stable and, and grounded, lovely. Something you're aware of, something you're not aware of. Recent past, immediate future, and potential outcome. Okay. Two of Swords with the Six of Cups and the Hierophant. You could have blocked somebody with a soul connection, um, Aquarius. And the Six of Cups could be somebody from the past with the Hierophant here as well. Maybe somebody you were committed to, possibly. But it was a bit of a nightmare sort of relationship. So, King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles, I kind of feel like he's possibly somebody older. There's three people in this dynamic. So the King of Pentacles. I'm not quite sure where out who's who at the moment. What you're aware of is the Four of Pentacles. So you're closed off to somebody. Possibly this past person. Possibly a Taurus. Either way, it's a strong soul connection. You've blocked them off. You've closed off to them. In your subconscious, I don't think you have. Queen of Wands. There's that looking back into the past. Sharing the passions that you had. But there could have been three people in dynamics. The recent past is the three of wands. The immediate future is the king of cups. Could be a water sign, not important though, but. I kind of feel like there's somebody coming in. Somebody coming in that's new. And I'm going to be completely honest, um, Aquarius, it's not going to work out because the outcome is the Five of Cups. And the reason why it's not going to work out is because you are too busy looking back in the past. Let's see. Let's get some clarifiers. So maybe somebody just, maybe you just, you think you've moved on from somebody and you haven't. So if that's the case, maybe just stay single for a bit. Take some time to for yourself. Because I kind of feel like if you start moving forward with this King of Cups energy, it's just going to end in disappointment. Let's see. Three more. the page of swords, the seven of swords and the queen of wands yeah you're spying on them this could be them to you if I'm honest Aquarius um, this very well be, could be somebody 
I'm almost getting like here a real strong soul connection um, and you're both with different people because we've got a we've got a king of pentacles the king of cups on the board we've got a queen of wands and we've also got a queen of cups uh, I mean don't get caught up in genders we all have sort of um, masculine feminine energies but I kind of feel like you're both with separate people and they're both going to end up in disappointment in these relationships that you're in because of your feelings towards each other does that make any sense? so the current energy is the king of pentacles with the two of cups so there's there's, there's love there certainly with a earth sign very strong Taurus energy I will point out uh, it doesn't have to be, they could just have Taurus in their placements um, but it could indicate just a strong soul connection something very very um, almost feel like meant to be what you're aware of is the four of pentacles with the hierophant so you've blocked off from this person now you've closed off from them um, maybe because they had somebody else, you had somebody else what you're not aware of is the queen of wands is with the six of pentacles and I'm taking the six of pentacles as, a, as indicating balance in the fact that you're both in the exact, you're mirroring each other neither of your relationships are going to work out because of your attachment to each other in the recent past is the three of wands with the queen of cups so there's the queen of cups here um, there's been love but there was third party situation um, in, in your dynamic and obviously it's, it's ended somehow um, it's going to be different for a lot of you third party doesn't have to be people it can be anything distance it could be and it could well be, well be distance here she's looking out onto the sea um, separate countries possibly you know however it fits could be work it could be anything family you name it children immediate future is the king of cups with the judgment decision a call a realization I kind of feel like you're both going to go through if whoever I'm connecting with here, you, you and your past person are both going to go through a breakup um, because of how you feel for each other. So the outcome is the Five of Cups with the Knight of Cups. It's going to end because of this love that you have for each other. Um, yeah, mirroring each other, you're both stuck on the past and you both can't move forward because um, there's too much love there. So you got to make that judgement call. I almost feel like it's going to be a domino effect in the sense that if you... If you cut away from your person... Yeah, the Father of Swords. If you cut away from your person, end that. Then that sets a chain reaction. With a moon here. It's kind of like... Um, the best way to describe what I'm trying to say. I'm taking the moon as like a mystery here. It, it's like a mysterious sort of knock-on effect. It's like it's like an energetic pull. When one of you breaks it off with their person, the other one will do the same. It's weird. Can't really um, can't really explain that. So, Aquarius, let me know if this resonates because it's a bit of a strange one. Um, so whoever I'm connecting with here is dwelling on the past past person um, they're doing exactly the same and neither your or their relationship with their current person is going to last because of this um, so yeah come clean or however it fits with you communicate ok Aquarius you could be dealing with a Scorpio Pisces Cancer strong very strong Taurus but we've got cups we've got pentacles we've got wands we've got swords everybody's here and those are your standouts though okay let me know if it resonates um, look after yourselves thank you for following the channel and I'll see you soon